Hundreds have joined the search for Michael Bryson, and they are not slowing down five days later. KZI 9 News reporter Emma Jerome went to the site where he was last seen and spoke to his family. At this point, we have no good leads to follow up on. But still, the search for 27-year-old Michael Bryson continues. Certain areas we've searched three, four, five times just to make sure. Bryson was camping at the Hobo Camp campground with some friends last week when he wandered away from the site on Wednesday morning. That was the last time he was seen. Friends, family, strangers, people that we haven't heard from in 20 years all of a sudden to show up. Um, we've had a lot of community members. Search is not only isolated to just the campground and surrounding areas. Friends have deployed into cities all over western Oregon looking for any leads that could point them to where he might be. His family is saying the longest they've ever gone without hearing from him is two days. It's pretty rare that, um, especially five days in, that he would have not reached out to mom and dad or sister. The effort to find Michael has grown beyond just those who know him. I mean, every day we've had a couple hundred people up here volunteering their time. A Facebook group with over 2,000 members is dedicated to finding the young man. Speaking a little bit with Michael's dad, he told me Michael didn't know a stranger. He was friendly and kind to everyone that he met. He hopes that's the energy that brings him home. A $5,000 reward has now been doubled for any information leading to his discovery, all which was donated to fuel efforts to find him. Reporting in Dorena Emma Jerome, KEZI 9 News.